Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster, and welcome back to Let's Play Wing Commander Privateer Righteous Fire. Well, last time we successfully flew a very far mission for Sandra Gooden, and I made my way back here off screen. Uh, just because I didn't need to show you the return flight, I felt that wasn't necessary. Also, I took some other missions, and now I've got 88,000 cash. Basically, I did a uh, some scout missions as I was leaving New Caledonia System. And so now what I can do is I can go and I can purchase the best scanner in the game. So let's go ahead and sell my Hunter AW there. And now I want to purchase the BS Omni. I believe that's the one I want to get. Yeah, so you can see it's the most expensive scanner in the game. Let's go ahead and get that. Yes, I would like to buy that scanner, please. Thank you. Okay, I think I've, I think I've gotten, I think I've bought all these maps already. So we should be good to go. Yeah, okay. Very good. So now I've gotten all the best stuff in the game. So now all I need to do is just now start getting upgrades, which is uh, just for convenience sake. So that's cool. So let's talk to Sandra Gooden and see what she has for us today. Excellent. You really stuck it to them. You've been doing the Confederation a great service. You know me. I'm all heart. I've got one more mission for you. It's the toughest one we've got right now. We need to continue battling the Kilrathi presence in Confed space. Fly to the Regalis system. Patrol all nav points. Destroy all Kilrathi vessels. Then return here for 10,000. All right, sounds good. It's pretty far away, but I can handle it. Sounds straightforward. See you soon. Yep, it'll be all good. All right, let's see if there's any missions for us. I did such a pretty good job of handling Actually, hold on. I did such a pretty good job of handling the Kelrathi Kel the last time that I should be just fine. Actually, that's just a patrol mission. I'm going to need to land at, let's see, Chronicer. So let's see if there's anything there. I highly doubt it, but you never know. Nope. 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 And no. Okay. So I didn't think so, but you never know. Okay, let's check the Mercenaries Guild. And, you know, I was able to, let's see, bounty mission, no, attack mission, uh, Ragnarok, am I heading there? No, I'm not. And shoot down some Kilrathi in, at nav point six. Sure. Why not? I, it's, I've been able to knock out my enemies pretty darn quickly, so I'm not too worried about it. Okay, let's see what we got here. And let's just do some scout missions, just because you never know if you're going to run into uh, enemies there or not. Okay, very good. All right, let's go. All right. And there's our new scanner, so I'll get a chance to show it off here in just a little bit. Now, our destination is we're going to start pretty much by going the same way we took before. And we need to go to Tingerhof. Okay, so let's head over to Nav 1. Check out what's going on over there. Oh man, it is kill Rafi. All right, fair enough. But now I can push the L button, to lock onto them. And also, yeah. So once I lock onto it, it makes it much easier for missiles to to, 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 uh, to target them. Also, we can easily see now missiles that might be launched our way because of the, of the yellow dots uh, on the scanner now. Before they were just gray dots, but now they're yellow. So, again, it's not the most crucial upgrade in the world, but, you know, it's, uh, it's something. Ooh, these gothers are coming at me in full force. I'm not messing around. Well, that's fine. Okay, come on, Godfrey. Sit still. Alright, let's try a missile. See, that's going right after the enemy. Oh, whoa. Well, at least it distracted him long enough to... Oh, for me to make the kills. Okay, two more Godfrey's. Or no, this is a Drawthy. Okay, so a Drawthy, and just more kill Rathi in general. I'll take them out real quick and be back. Thank you. All right. Have I hit the nav point yet? I don't know if I have yet. Nope. 
Okay, so it's auto to get my destination a little bit closer. All right. Now I'll go touch this nav point. We'll be good. In the first part of this, I'll probably edit out a bunch of this, just because you've seen me do this so much. And then we'll get to the extra. Then we'll get to the actual mission. I'm just doing this because it it's easy. Okay, very good. Just get within 2,000 clicks. And then we'll head to Nav 2. And there's nothing at Nav 2. Brilliant. Free money. Woohoo! I love free money. And if you happen to come across some free money and would like to make a donation, feel free to check out my donations page. <laughs> no, seriously, check out my donations page. Okay, sorry. Enough of that. You never, you know... It's never too late for some shameless self-promotion. Right? I don't know. <laughs> no, I just make, I make my videos purely for the enjoyment and entertainment of the BCS universe. And because it's fun. Okay, so I got my nav point, and our goal is gonna be Tinker. Wait, oh, is this an attack mission? Oh, I actually do need to destroy the ships here. Oh, okay. I forgot this is an attack mission. I can't even remember what I'm doing. But they're drouthy, so this shouldn't take too long. Okay, I'll just shoot down one. By the way, I seem to be, uh... For some reason, I seem to be able to shoot my guns a little more. I don't know why. I don't think I've, I've made any adjustments to my to my shield or my gun capacity. And you know, I've been playing Wing Commander for... I would guess... close to 15 years now? Yeah, because I started playing when I was... Uh, my first Wing Commander experience was Wing Commander 3 on the PC, and I got that when I was in high school. So, yeah, I've been playing Wing Commander for about 15 years now. And um, I haven't I've never adjusted my shields or anything like that. It just You can if you want. And, uh, but I've never needed to, and um, I just don't think it's what I need to do. I, I just like to have a good balance. So, okay, I'll finish these drop these off and be right back. I am battered human, yet unbeaten. Well, we'll see about that, punk. There you go. Got him. Woohoo! All right. Now let's make our way to Tinkerhoff, and we can do the actual part of the mission today. Maintain speed and course for contraband search. No contraband detected. You may proceed. I know. Ooh, Stiletto. Hey, how you doing, Stiletto? Man, she was always in, uh... She was always on my wing in Wing Commander uh, Prophecy. That's good to see her there. I think it's the ship's name is Stiletto, Stiletto and it's not actually Stiletto. But, there you are. Whee! All right. And nothing there. And just like before, we want to now head to Nexus. So let's head up there. And so far, so good. By the way, on my return flight to Perry in the last mission, I destroyed about another 10 Talons. So I'm, we'll check my numbers, but I bet I'm well into the 100s of Talon kills, which makes me so happy because Talons suck. Both li literally and figuratively. They're really bad in this game. Plus, they just also start to get annoying after a while. Okay. Now, here in Nexus, we're going to well, keep the same path. And we're going to head to the Capella system. Just like before. Yeah, pretty much. Prepare to be searched. Maintain speed and course. No contraband detected. You may proceed. Thank you. I don't like, they really like checking me for contrabands for some reason. It's kind of weird. I don't think I've done anything illegal. But, you never know. Whee! Alright. Now here we're going to mix it up a little bit. Instead of going to Crab 12, this time, we're going to go to Sherwood. That's our destination. But it looks like they're not going to let us leave. Okay. And now I get some Talons, my first Talons of the day. Oh! Woohoo! Look at how fast I'm wiping out those Talons. Woohoo! Look at that hardware fly! 
Stupid town. Alright, get back here. Come on. Fire! Yeah, so I might be able to really take them down. Uh, now that I've now that I've got the uh, better scanner and I can lock onto them, it makes my hit percentage of my missiles go way up. Not that I really get not that I really use missiles, but they're there just in case. I get close. What was that? Sorry, I missed that after over the sound of you dying. <laughs> all right, one more town. Now I might not show all of my kills today because there's actually a lot going on today. Oh, there you go. Awesome. Now we'll head over to Sherwood. And ugh. and you know what? I. I'll try and take these guys out, but if I don't, I am not worried about it. In fact, you know what? I'm just going to go straight to the jump point. This guy's... Ain't nobody got time for that. Go! Ooh. A little damage there, but that's alright. Ooh! Took a little more damage than I thought. Okay. Okay, so maybe it wasn't such a good plan, but... There you go. But fortunately, I have talons to to uh, help ease the pain. Now, I probably shouldn't ram at this point just because... Whew, just because uh, I need to repair my ship. There you go. Is that it? Okay, cool. Now, from here, we want to go... There's the regala system. Very good. Uh... It's, yeah, we'll head off for an afterburn over there. But I might take a moment and just let all, everything repair. And it looks like I'm not going to get the chance. Actually, I'll just kill these Talons. And that should be enough. Oh, yeah, it's just a couple of Talons. No problem. And that should be enough to, uh, to let my ships repair. So, okay. Again, normally I would show more of the killing, but... Uh, I'm, I've got a lot going on. So I'll just finish off these talents real quick and be back. Well, actually, it might not even matter. Damn, you're yeah, I am. Apart. Okay, it didn't matter. Lovely. And everything's repaired. Very good. Okay. So now let's make our jump to the Regala system, which is our destination. And the orange ones represent, uh, those look like ejected seats, I think. Not sure. Oh, well. All right. Now we'll head over to Regalis. Very good. All right. Looks like we got some company. Talons. They're not a nuisance. Well, they are a nuisance, but they're more just annoying than they are anything else. They're not really a threat. Yeah, so I guess nuisance is the right word, because they're definitely not a threat. Come on. I really wish that missiles in this game would... Uh, you could one-shot... Would cause you to one-shot, uh... Some ships, like, they, like I could in Wing Commander 3. Of course, I wish a lot of more Wing Commander games, Wing Commander games would follow the, uh general AI script of, or I guess, ship loadout of Wing Commander. That was pretty, pretty, that was pretty good. Okay, uh, so anyways, I'll finish, oh, yikes! This thing's coming at me. Okay, so I'll finish up with these Talons and be back. Oh! Two in a row! Very nice. Okay, so it looks like we have a bunch of different, uh, Patrols to make, and we're gonna have to land at the Kronecker mining base eventually. Wait, where am I here? Okay, nav point cleared. Very good. So let's go in reverse order. Let's head over to nav three. Let's see what we got over there. Because we're just gonna make a circle. Alright. Oh boy. They say unknown, but we I recognize that ship. Those are Gothries. Alright. Come on, Mr. Gothry. 
Yeah, we're, we're managing to hold pretty well uh, with the afterburn fuel, so that's good. Now, one thing about the God 3s also is that they're, the ship is so thin that sometimes it can make your shots hard to, to hit, so just watch for that. But with enough practice, you should be able to take them down, no problem. And draw these. Now, I tried to ram and draw the earlier, and it was fine. But it ended up causing some damage to my to my ship, and I think I've mentioned before. Avoid ramming Drawthies if you can. Now, if you get into a pinch, uh, you can do it, and, and it'll be fine. But, again, if you can avoid it, just shoot them down, and that'll be more effective. There you go. And now one more. Oh, I thought I was going to take it down pretty quick. I thought I might have missed. I say I might have. I did miss. Oh! Yes! Okay. And nav point is cleared. Very good. Alright, now let's head up to nav 2. And remember, you can tell the nav point is clear simply by seeing if the text has turned dark. And... Uh-oh! It's more of these unknown fighters! Uh-oh! Alright. Well... I don't know if these things have seen my new weapons. So... This is... This is I think this is my first test against the against these unknowns with with all my tack with all my four tachyon guns and my upgraded well definitely my upgraded scanner but more concerned about the tachyon guns and my upgraded speed. So let's see how we're gonna do here today. And I think I mentioned last time, and you guys know what these fighters are. And I don't know if this ever get, becomes revealed what these fighters are, but Missile. Again, these things, they move pretty quick. So it's tough to keep on a lock for one place. It's tough to keep them... It's tough to keep them, uh... Still. So if you want to use a couple of missiles, it's okay. Kind of like when you're fighting Flash. There you go. Oh! Okay. Now, one more unknown fighter, and I'll just use a combination of missiles and guns to take it down. And I'll be back once I'm done with it. Now, the reason I'm editing out is because these unknowns usually take a little while longer. Just how fast they are. Boom! There you go. Got him. Oof, that was tricky, though. Those unknown fighters think they could stop me. They had no clue what they were dealing with. And, of course, how fitting is it that I get to just that my ending uh, clearing is Talons. Uh, ooh, looks like we have a bunch of them today. That's fine. Well, just three. So three more Talons. Again, you should know by now how I feel about Talons. Ha ha ha! Wasn't even able to activate his escape pod. Sit still! Make you too good for me, Mr. Talon. Okay. Woo! Yeah, there you go. Oh! Alright, one more Talon. You can tell he shot a missile at me. Uh, I think these Talons are starting to catch on. There you go. Got him. All right, I believe everything is cleared. Yes, now we definitely need to land. So we're gonna head over to the Chronicler mining base and uh, land and refuel. So that will be important. Uh, wait, wait a minute. No! no, 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 damn it. Two missions in a row and two asteroid fields. Uh, they would have an asteroid field in the middle of a base just to spite me. Avoid these asteroids. Whoa, Jesus! Dang it! I did not pay attention there. Yeah, look out. I'm trying to worry about what's about not getting shot at. And sometimes these sometimes these asteroids are being Oh jeez! Holy crap! Man. Whoa, where's the base? There it is. So that's that's what asteroid that's what asteroids can do to you, BCS universe. And I'm getting 
entering I'm getting an thrown off because landing, I can't see them sometimes because they're being disguised by the base. Ugh! And the curse of asteroids tries to screw with me again. Ugh! Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just make my way back uh, to Sandra Gooden because this is our last Gooden mission and I want to see what her final... Uh, what her final words to me will be. I'm sure we can take some extra missions as we go. Uh, pfft, and I just want to get there as quickly as I can. Patrol, no. Attack, you know what, not really. I just, like I said, I just want to get back there as soon as I can and be done with my stuff today. So a scout mission I think would be fine. But, uh, yeah, I'll, like scout and Navy 3 is fine. Scout, sure. Cool. Okay. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna make my way back to the to the base, back to Perry Naval Base. Just go back the same way through starting in Regalis, go through Sherward, Capello, Nexus, then Tingerhoff, and then finally to Perry. And I'll just meet you there, and then we'll talk with Sandra Gooden and see what she has to say. All right, and we successfully made it back to the Perry Naval Base. So let's talk to Sandra Gooden and let's see what she's got for us. Well, Regalis is free from the furball menace. I've been informed. Excellent work. I don't have any more missions for you, but I do have a tip. The Confederation has posted a bounty for the death of Governor Manesh. You may have heard of him. He's done a lot of illegal dealing with the Karathi. If you ever come across him, destroy him. Come back here when you do, and I'll get you the 40,000 bounty. Good deal. Ooh, 40,000 credit for destroying a governor. That sounds good. And now we're ready to see Masterson. Or are we? Y'all have to wait till next time to find out. So then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Don't forget to like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter at BCS Buster LP, check out my blog, check out my donations page, and as always, take care, y'all.